Hey everybody, this is a video of the 400 watt self ballasted mercury halogen tubular light bulb. As you can see here, it says SW Clark LTD, that stands for limited, premium uh, quality lighting and lamps. Yep, that's right. And on here it says self ballasted metal halide lamp. Yes, that's right. So on here it says self ballasted meta halide lamp. 220 to 240 volts slash 50 hertz 246 slash e40 that's edison 40 that's right and it's got uh 400 watts yep that's right and it says can connect to direct main supply and it says do not connect uh, with the the ballast to main supply it says uv stop do not use if the bulb's broken yep that's right it's got the barcode it says made in prc yep that's right and um, it says, caution to avoid breaking and early failure of the lamp bulb. Please strictly follow the guidelines below. Yep, that's right. This lamp can be worked direct directly with 220 to 240 volts, not need ballast. Yep, that's right. So I'm going to get it out of its box and you'll see in one second or two, everybody. So right, I'm going to tip it up. That's it now, the bulb's out of its box now. I'll put its box on here, so. <coughs> so. So anyway, here I have the uh, the 400 watt self-ballasted mercury halogen tubular light bulb. Yep, that's right. And it's got a bigger arc tube in it. And it's got the halogen filament inside it. Yep, that's right. And it's got the Edison 40 screw cap. Yep, that's right. So anyway, I'm going to... Uh, Screw it into the lamp now, so... Right, it's just taking its time to go down tightly. Right. That's it now. It's in tightly now, it's fitted in like so. So, anyway, I'm going to uh, turn off the uh, uh, table lamp now, so... That's it now. The lamp's gone out now, so onto the 400 self ballasted um, mercury halogen tubular bulb, everybody. So, uh, ready? After three. One, two, three. Wow! That's very bright. Yep, as I say, it's 400 watts bright. Uh, and as you can see, it starts with the halogen filament. Yep, that's right. And it's the halogen filament kicks in. And it'll change to mercury vapor soon, but it does start with the halogen, uh, yeah, the halogen filament. Yep, yeah, that's right. So anyway, I'm going to take a good look into the into the bulb now. As you can see, the filament has just fully kicked in, and uh, you can't see that. Well, you can see the mercury gas, but it's it's flickering because it's just come on. It's it'll flare up in one sec, in one minute or two. Let's take a good look up at the ceiling. Yep. Oh, yeah, it's really, really, really bright. And then look all around my room and everything. And, um, sorry about my burping, yeah. And it's lit my breakfast tea table really, really bright. Yep, that's right. So, and as you can see now, it starts with the halogen filament. Yep, that's right. And, um, it's, a. Uh, that's what it does. It ballasts the mercury art tube. And let's take a good look over above. Can you see over above? Yeah. It's like a, it's like a alcoholic tube you usually have if you had those vodka shots. Yep, that's right. And as you can see now, it looks like the the mercury art tubes. Uh, looks like it's starting to change to mercury now. So, oh, yep, you, you can see it now. Let's take a good zoom close to it. Oh God, it is really bright. I can't stare at it for too long. Oh, it is. It's getting really red hot. But it is 400 watts bright and 400 watts hot. Yep, that's right. So, and as you can see. Yeah, and it's it's like it's got like blue. It's got the blue reflection around the glass. Yeah, so as you can see now, the the bulbs fully changed to mercury. Yeah, and as a as you can see, like I said, this is a the bulb that came from eBay yesterday, and that came with the two hundred and fifty watt self ballasted mercury vapor light bulb. Yep, that's right. But anyway. As you can see now, as I pan the camera, so you can see the ghost reflection. It's like you see it in the reflection, the uh, halogen uh, 
the halogen and the mercury gas together. Yep, that's right. As you can see, it's like a it's like a sausage in a way. Let's take another good look into it. As you can see, oh, I know it's can't you? Yeah, it's like a very bluish color that that mercury arc to well the gas actually, but the but the incandescent you know, the halogen filament uh, is like a very goldy color. Yeah, that's right. So, well, anyway, I'm going to turn it off and turn it back on and see what happens. Here we go. Oh, that's it now. It's see the bits of the electric electrofilaments lighting up. But as you can see now, it, it's gone out now. So I'm going to, uh, as I as I say, I'm going to switch this bulb back on. So, and as you can see, you see bits of the mercury art gas uh, uh, appearing, but it'll fade away. Yeah, I can see now it's starting to fade away as I turn it back on. Yeah, so. It's uh, I'll see how long this one will take to stop off. So, uh, please wait, everybody. But as I'm talking, all I can hear now is just the clock ticking. We'll see how long this one takes to uh, uh, re-strike up again. So, it's a good job. It's another clear one I've got. So I say it's the same size as that 250 watt one. Yeah, but as you can see now. Uh, it's fully gone out, but I've turned it back on, so it's on at the switch, so it's on now, but it, it won't come back on straight away. It'll stop off for about a minute or two, everybody, so so please wait. <coughs> oh, it's just me sniffling, sorry about that. Might take its time though, but all I'm doing now is just a complete blackout. But I've left the blue LED lights on, but I don't want to pan the tam tablet straight away just yet because I don't want to miss out in case it lights up without the tablet looking directly at it. But all I'm going to do now is just sit very patiently. It'll take its time though. What's it doing now? I see a little bit of reflection, some of the type of lights I can see, but can you see. Well, Mister, what are you doing? Taking your time, are you? It's not doing no. It. Seems to be taking its time. It's about eight. Yep. I was gonna about to say, but it's about nine minutes now, so so all I'm gonna do is wait for another minute or two, see how long it's gonna take. Is he doing no yet? Here we go. Wow, that's just uh, fully come back on now. It just flickered a bit. It sounded a bit like a bell dinging. But anyway, as you can see now, the, the halogen filaments just kicked in again. Yep, that's right. And as you can see now, it'll, it'll start with the halogen filament again. What do you usually say? Incandescent. 
But that's what the halogen uh, filament does. It, it ballasts it. It does give out 400 watts of light. It's the same size as the other one. The other one I've got gives out 250, but this one gives out 400. Yep, that's right. And as you can see, now let's take a good look. See, is it, is it starting to flare up? Is it? Oh, hang on. Oh, yeah, looks like the, the mercury gas is flaring up now, but it'll start to warm up. But the the uh, the halogen uh, filament has already warmed up anyway, so I can feel the heat now. Looks like now it's started to change to uh, mercury, as you can see, as it's just fully flared back up. Yeah. So, um, as you can see now, um, let's take a good look upon the ceiling. Yep. Uh, let's look all around. And, uh, yep, it's uh, panning, uh, so I can see a bit of a greenish colour in the shadow over there near towards my fireplace where that fuse switch is. But as you can see now, it's like the, the mercury arc tube's starting to, uh, starting to change now. It's fully changed to mercury. Is it going to get in any further just yet? But, <clears throat> so we'll just see. Let me just uh, take another good look at this uh, it's carton. As you can see now, I don't know what SW stands for, but it's, but I know Clark, but LTD stands for Limited, but I don't know what uh, SW stands for. I really don't. So, and all it says around there. So, so it is it uh, dotted? I don't know why they've dotted it like that, but usually to say the actual wattage, saying so say which wattage is it, but we know it's four hundred watts. Yep, that's right, and it's got the barcode. I know, I know I've said this before. And it's got CE both ways. Yep, that's right. So, as you can see now, yep, from my eyes now, and I can't look directly at it with my eyes, but I'd look at it through the, through the tablet. It has uh, fully changed to Mercury. Let's take another good look into it now. So, as you can see, yep, it has now. It's fully changed to Mercury. As, you can, as I came towards it, you can, you can feel the heat. It's very, very hot. Yep, that's right. It does. It's about 400 watts hot or 400 degrees hot, I should, however I want to say it. And there's all my fruit and my breakfast tea table. It has lit up my flat room 400 watts bright. Yeah, that's in my uh, ceramic lamp holder with all tapes on it. So I had to stick it down with white tack so it doesn't move. So... Anyway, as you can see now, it is a, it's a full mercury now, full mercury vapour, or as I say, Freddie Mercury. Yeah, so, as you can see now, it's fully brightened up now, at 400 watts bright, so I'm going to turn it off now, again, so. Right, that's it now. As you can see now, the, the, the gas and the halogen filaments fading away now. It fades away very slowly because it's halogen, yeah. And as you can see now, I can see bits of the uh, halogen uh, uh, incandescent gas is still uh, f showing up. So anyway, I'm going to uh, put this lamp back on now. So right, that's it now. The the big lamp, yeah, the table lamp's back on now. So so this is the video of the 400 yeah 400 watt self ballasted mercury halogen tubular light bulb everybody so i hope you all enjoyed this video so please comment rate and subscribe thank you for watching everybody